Hump day. Doing coffee. We're live. No steel. We know what's going on here. Alright. Second. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, they didn't. It's familiar with my channel. You know what's going on. Everybody knows what goes on around here on this channel. So, a minute. So let's see the background for a second. <laughs> um, I'll level select. Too young to die. Play level. Alright, we're good to go. Guys, a few minutes. Jeans, come on. Options. Alright. Live. What? Shut up. <laughs> Probably some fucking half breasted naked girl. I just followed him. Yeah, good for you. This thing I don't seem to understand. Welcome to the stream. The one thing I don't understand on Twitter is whenever I tw tweet something. Um, half naked chicks come on to my stream and start or my comment feed and um, literally start following me or whatever. It's like, oh, come on, this is annoying. This is very annoying. So, I don't know. I don't know why they do it, why they feel the need to do it. Um, makes no sense. I don't know. I can't figure it out to save my life. Um, it's pretty crazy. It's one of those things is like, yeah, that's kind of crazy. Um, welcome to this. No, you already welcomed. Uh, but I hope everybody was having a good week this week. Um, I, I did. I had a decent week. Um, uh, wasn't too bad. Um, be doing some Christmassy stuff this weekend or this week or whatever. Go to the holiday lights uh, tomorrow. So, kind of looking forward to that. It's going to be kind of cool. Welcome to the stream. Appreciate it, you. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Not what I wanted to do. There we go. Hey, bro. How you doing? How's everything going today? Hopefully, uh... Everything's well. Me, yeah, everything. I literally just have my sh shotgun. I'm doing well. Doing pretty good, actually. Ready to start the holiday season? You're okay, you guess. Okay. Well, I guess if you're guessing, 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 I guess that's that's cool. Um, I definitely start blasting each other. <laughs> and I said, I guess if you're guessing, guessing, I guess that's good. It's fine. I can live with that. you all right <clears throat> so yes yeah, so last week I did not do uh, I did not do doom and coffee last week um, due to the fact that I didn't want to drink too much coffee I had already drank a lot of coffee to begin with so I was like nah, I'm not gonna do that um, uh, I said I told the story about making myself sick I made myself throw up one time. I was like, yeah, this sucks. So, 
I wasn't happy about it. <laughs> I threw up. I, I almost threw up. I almost puked. I was like, no, I don't want to throw up. I didn't want to puke. I didn't want to either. I didn't want to throw up. I didn't feel like doing it. <laughs> you fucking kidding me. Get off me. Another one. Where the fuck is he coming from? Anymore? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Get off me. Just checking my camera position real quick. Guys just come out of fucking nowhere. Fuckers. Fucking kidding me. Get off me. <laughs> So I was playing uh, DMC5 tonight, or this afternoon, actually. Tonight, yeah. uh, I met it this afternoon. I was using my uh, Series S console, and uh, I don't care what anybody thinks of that system is actually a phenomenal system but he has any chance to go pick one up definitely do because it's definitely worth it it's a good backup if you already have a series x you might as well grab a series s if you're like if you're anybody like me who has a you know has a family i have my son and my wife and my son likes to come home and take over my tv so i uh let them have it and I just move my hard drives over to the other the other side of uh, where my uh, gaming monitor is and uh, so I was playing DMC today and uh, you again god damn um, so I was looking at the the specs and stuff and I was like you know what I'm gonna mess with my settings I'm gonna share this with you guys if you guys are if anybody is a uh, series S or series X owner and you have a 60 Hertz television um, believe me when I say this your TV can handle 120 I know this sounds crazy but your TV can definitely handle 120 you just have to set it uh, basically your um, your TV you have to set your TV to accept the 120 frames um, you also have to have a game that actually uh, supports that so bear in mind you go into your TV display settings, you hit override on your display settings. You click up, um, come on, damn it. 
uh, you click there. Uh, I think you click you you click override, and you yeah you click override, and then you turn on uh 12, 32 bit or something like that, and then you go ahead and you turn on a uh, variable refresh rate and. 24, 24 and 50 hertz, and then 120 uh, frames. It said 120 FPS, and it should support it. And I was playing DMC this morning, actually, uh, in 120 frames. It was, oh man, it actually was not bad. It looked really good. For me personally, on this TV, I'd rather take 60 frames or 30 frames with uh, ray tracing. So I prefer that. But if like I'm playing on a Series S and it only offers high frame rates, then I'll go ahead and use my settings and mess with it. And not really mess with it, but you know, uh, change the fidelity or scan. Uh, the fidelity overscan, uh, what is it? Fidelity overscan settings, and uh, crank it up to 120. And I didn't really, honestly, it didn't have it a single fucking issue. I thought like it was, I thought my controller was gonna glitch out on me, and no, it was good. It was best freaking time I ever had playing. DMC, I was like, oh man, this is cool. And that was on my uh, 4K monitor. So, little trick for you uh, Series S or Series X owners. Hit your fidelity, your fidelity uh, settings, and you can go ahead and crank her up to 120 frames a second. It's just beautiful. Son of a bitch. <sighs> it's better. Shit. Oh, anyways. Oh, yeah. Uh, I forgot to talk about <laughs> I forgot to talk about the giveaway. Um, I announced on Twitter and I think, yeah, Twitter. I announced on Twitter that I'm going to be doing a uh, a live box giveaway. Which is if anybody wonders what that is, it's uh, you will get a uh, a headset. No, I'm not signing them. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not that famous. I'm not gonna sign them. Yeah. Um, but you will get a live box setting, or a live, a live box set, live box setup. A uh, headset. The camera that I use for my streams is the one that I have here. And it's on my, you know, somewhat good-looking face, whatever, however you want to call it, whatever. Um. And, uh, yeah, whatever you want to call it, <laughs> um, semi good looking face, whatever, ew, <laughs> eat your, my, eat my, never mind. I'm not going to say it, but, um, the camera that I use along with, uh, a USB hub, uh, it's black. It does not work with my Series X at all. Um, for some reason, it was just not working properly. So, uh, yeah, I'll include that in the live box giveaway. The headset, the camera, and the USB, and it should be able to get you going on a uh, on streaming. So, all I need is a Twitch account and. Uh, and you can make that up, and you're good to go. And say starter, 
start a live box is basically what it is so i will announce the winner on christmas eve so stay tuned for that um and i talked about it all you gotta do is uh tell me what game you absolutely have to play it could be new old whatever do you play it daily do you play it all the time all you gotta do is just answer what game do you play or what game do you want to play or what game do you have to play um and it's yours and uh Vampire can tell me off camera, or he can tell me when he comes to visit on Sunday or whatever, and or if he wants to, you know, whatever. That's it. See if he wins. If he wins, he can just come and get it because he lives very close to where I am. So, Vampire, you've yet to answer the question: What game do you have? To, do you absolutely have to play? Um. Can be new, old, doesn't matter. You just gotta tell me. And you're eligible to win the live box giveaway. So. So is that the game you absolutely have to play, Dark Sliders? Dark Siders. So that's the game you absolutely have to play. Alright, alright, okay. Cool. That works. Alright. Well, there you are. You are now registered into the drawing. I'll see if anybody else comments and says anything. And uh I'll announce the winner on uh, Christmas Eve. Or Warframe, okay. All right, so between those two, all right, that no, that works. Fortunately, I cannot stream more frame. It's just bullshit. Sucks. Um, another thing, I had to uh, get a new controller this morning. Uh, ran me about seventy bones, and uh, yeah, say uh silver controller it's kind of cool is it really cool um and he is so smooth and it just runs like butter oh that's where you guys are i shall shoot you No, 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 You little bastard. Fuck off. <laughs> Any zombie games, huh? Oh, that makes two of us. Well, you... I guess... You're supposed to... You're supposed to get... Your live back so we can... Play Left 4 Dead. Or back for blood, whatever. Whichever one comes first. <laughs> of course.
course I know it. Of course I know. You know damn well that I love zombie games myself, so... Why do you think I like Doom so much? <laughs> Not necessarily a zombie game, but... It definitely got some zombie elements to it. No, nah, that didn't work. <laughs> right? Us and our zombie games. Eh, very true. Very, very true. But, everybody that knows us, they know damn well that we love our damn zombie games. And it's just something that we can't get enough of. So you don't like it? Off. <laughs> it's too bad. Wasn't that Left 4 Dead or was that... Yeah, it was Left 4 Dead. You kept fucking... Sh yeah. Jerk. <laughs> Took my shit away from me, asshole. How fucking dare you? That's not nice. <laughs> I know it's sniping. Damn it. <laughs> I know what it was. I remember I was sitting right there when you did it. I think he did it on the Xbox. <laughs> Literally, this fucking asshole comes into my comes in comes to my place. <laughs> comes to my place. So of course, what does my dumbass do? I fucking challenge him, and uh, he pretty much. Yeah. He pretty much licked the floor with my ass. Is that pretty much how it happened, bro? You licked the floor with me? <laughs> I was like that best out of five or some bullshit. Like, I'm not really sure what it was. Fucking... I don't think it was licked. I no. I meant mop the floor, not lick the floor, but whatever. Still the same concept. Pretty much got my rear end kicked. I quit this one out. Pretty much got my rear end kicked the whole entire time. It was bad. It was bad. It was bad. Very bad. Very bad. Very, very bad. He did too. He won every fucking match. He literally won every goddamn match. Fucker. I don't even know what the hell to do. I'm like, what do I do? Wasn't Kevin with us at that time, too? I think Kevin was with us at the time. I don't remember. No, I just know not to open my big fucking mouth anymore and say, oh, we're rocking. Or can I drink you or whatever? Nah, I just learned my lesson. Don't do it. Just don't fucking do it. I wasn't even with Angie at the time, was I? I don't remember. That's a long fucking time ago, dude. That's like ancient history. Oh, 
Oh man, the good old days. Hey dude, shut up. Uh, yeah, before, before either one of them. Do not, I do not, I do not, I will never do that again. I have a family, no. That's all I need to do is fucking be passed out on the floor and Angie can't wake me because guess what? I'm too drunk. And plus I work, I have a job, so no. Not happening. Actually, they ask her what kind of what kind of um, what kind of whiskey do you have at your house? Just want to bring some over. I got some glasses, and no, we're not getting into a drinking contest. We're gonna sit and enjoy it. <laughs> nothing, nothing. I just want to sit. Maybe have a glass of whiskey with my brother and fucking sit down and play some games. That's it. That's all I want to do. Nothing. I ain't challenging you. No. Why? Cause then we learned. Didn't I learn my lesson the last time I did that? Fucking passed out on the floor. Fucking son of a bitch. Trying to. Back when I had a PS2. Back in the back in the day. So. I think I've explained this to, to you guys before. Vampire and I, we became friends through a mutual company. We used to work for the printing company that I quit, uh, what was it, two years ago? Um, I, I just literally celebrated my two year anniversary. Um, last month, November. Yeah, so. So, anyways, fuckhead. Sometimes you do, not all the time. Not all the time. I'm actually learning to beat my own fucking games. So. But anyways, keep distracting me, vampire. Um, him and I used to work for the same company, the company that I just quit two years ago. So, him and I met. He seemed like seemed like a pretty cool dude. Um, well, I'm actually right now. I'm actually beating uh, the uh, DM Five. Don't make me cry five. And I'm doing it by myself. <laughs> I really didn't need him to beat the bosses for me in that game. I just wanted him to be able to play and enjoy it. See what he thinks for himself. See if he wants to actually get the game. He helped a little bit. Well, I'm for you. He helped a little bit. But anyways. Him and I, were fr him and I became friends. At the same company that I used to, I used to work for. So... Um, we became really good friends. Him and I've been fucking, dude. How long we've we been friends for? Something like 15, 15, 16 years, somewhere around there. So, anyways, <laughs> shut up. Um. Yeah. 
Anyways, I'm trying to tell people this story and you keep distracting me, fucker. <laughs> Something like that. So anyways, him and I made it him and I made a deal with company. So when I say hey, I want to you know, I'm at I'm at, I'm seeing a Sundance and you know, at the time and I was like, why don't you come on over, bring some liquor and uh we'll drink because I want to see if I can out drink your ass under the table. Of course, me and my big mouth, open mouth, insert foot, uh me on the floor with Kratos at the time. Yeah, it was my machine operator, one of my one of the operators. I was working you were my operator and I was your helper. So um anyways, yeah. So he he gets to my place and he's got all of this liquor. Like as much liquor as he can carry in his bag. So he shows up in this fucking bag. It's a ton of liquor. Ugh. Like, oh, a ton of liquor. So I tried to play at a, at a PlayStation 2 at the time. So I'm trying to play that. And I was playing God of War. What was it? One or two. I think it was like... I think it was one or two. I'm, I'm not really sure which one it was. I wanted... I want to see it was one. Couldn't be sure, but I was fucking gone. I was gone. I was literally running Kratos into the fucking wall and laughing in hysterics, and I was so fucking fucked up. So we forgot we had to go to work that night. Alcohol and surge, you know. We forgot we had to go to work that night. So, yeah. I am literally running the pallet jack into the fucking wall, and here is Vampire going, stay off the fucking jack, you stupid bastard. He's like, you're going to get yourself fucking fired. Stop it. So I just insisted on fucking going on the damn jack, and I wouldn't just stay off of it. So Sean finally like, just get off the jack. <laughs> I literally took the freaking pallet jack and rammed it into the fucking wall. Our old boss at the time... I was like, I gotta send him home. I've gotta send him home. He's too drunk. And, uh... Sean said, you know, Vampire says, Oh, it's my fault, man. I gave him the alcohol. I didn't realize he was gonna be that much of a fucking lightweight. <laughs> I was fucking gone. Way I was out of it. I am surprised I didn't throw up. I'm very surprised he didn't puke. Vampire, did I ever tell you about that time? I ever tell you about that time? It's like, well, way before you and I met. I was hanging out with uh, Kevin in his old house, his old apartment. And, uh. I decided to buy a bunch of alcohol, and I got, like, um, Aftershock. I will never, to this day, ever touch Aftershock anymore. Yeah. Um. It tends to make people throw up. <laughs> I did. I did. I he just reminded me I fell asleep in the shipping bathroom. Um. Yeah. Well, the the aftershock inf incident that I had. No, you can't. It, you can't find it anymore. Uh, it's. I'm so glad you can't because that stuff is so nasty. Anyways, so I was I was drinking hard liquor that night. I just literally the girlfriend that I was with broke up with me. Her and I split up, or we were done. Um, so I was depressed and upset, so I was drinking a lot of alcohol that night. I drank so much to the point to where I got sick, and I literally threw... I wanted a glass of water. I, I Steve Martin. I had Steve Martin with, me, with us. I'm like, Steve, can you give me a glass of water? But I drank all the water, but 10 minutes later, 
I empty the cup and then I'm filling it back up with vomit. I puked all over. I puked everywhere. I will never drink Aftershock ever again. That stuff is just terrible. I mixed I mixed alcohols at the time. I mixed, you know. Ugh. I think I mixed my like yeah, mixed my liquors. And that's what did me in. And that was part part of the reason why I got that in. Second part is it's aftershock and it's something that will make you it's just oh I can't do it. Well, this attractive. No, thanks, man. I'm I'm good. Thank you. Thank you for the offer, but I'm good. <laughs> um. So yeah, that was the that was the aftershock incident. Zero's attractiveism. Thank you. I appreciate it. But uh, no, I'm good. I'm actually gonna be posting. Most of my videos are going to be going on YouTube. I'm going to try to see if I can get that done. Um, so. You really can't. Aftershock is so hard to find, though. Still is hard to find. But, uh... Yeah, I'm good. I'm good with that. I don't need to pay any money. I can promote myself. I don't need it. I'm good. Fireball. Yeah. Um... Do you have any? Cause I can make this a fireball drink and dude, you're gonna love it. Um, I think it's what is it? Oh, what's it called? It's, it's called Fireball and uh, Flaming Hot Mountain Dew. You mix them both together and it oh, ha, 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 it's so good. It's literally the best drink you, it's literally the best drink you would ever drink. I'll have to get some. I'll probably have to get some. I'll have to get some fireball. Yeah, I'll see. I'll try to see if I can find the. I'll try to see if I can find the uh, the fireball. Not the not the whiskey. I'll see if I can try to find the um, flaming hot Mountain Dew. We'll make. Uh, we'll do. We'll do some of that. We're not getting drunk, but we'll just have a couple of drinks. <clears throat> I'm not doing that because it's dangerous. You know, if you actually take orange juice in a 40 and you dump orange juice into it, it this is called a brass monkey, and it's it's dangerous. It literally goes down too damn smooth. <laughs> Why is that good? Why is that so good? Ten minutes later, you drink the whole damn thing. You want another one, and you're throwing up again. No barfing for me. My barf days are over. I'll just make you. I'll make you fireball drink. It's actually really good. You'll like it. Go to um. If I'm out and about, if I happen to see someone, I'll pick some up. But 
go to Walmart and look for Flaming Hot Mountain Dew. See if we can find any. It's dangerous. It's too good. That's the problem. It's too good. You're you're the pot head that got me started on DiSerono too. Jerk. <laughs> that stuff is dangerous. Bah. Stuff will put you one way. It is, but when you add fireball to it, oh, it's. I can only have like one or two. It's good for a mixer. It is. It's good and dangerous at the same time. It's so damn good. It's dangerous because you can wind up drunk off your ass and not even know, not even know, not even think twice about it. And next thing you know, you're running pallet jacks into the freaking. No. No Jaeger and uh 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 uh. Jaeger makes me violent. I will not do that. No. Do not bring Jaeger Meister into this house. Sorry. There are many types of liquors that I should not be drinking at all. And, uh... One of them happens to be Jägermeister, and I can't do it. And I can't really drink uh, vodka either, because it makes me violent. Vodka makes me violent. Jack Daniels doesn't really make me violent, but vodka does. Jägermeister definitely makes me violent. If you think uh, you want to threaten violence against your egg suck, your egg sucker, mine. I almost did it. I almost killed her. <laughs> I got extremely violent. No, no, but I mean, like, I, no, it was, it was, it was Bacardi, um, I think it was Bacardi O, Vodka, it, something had, it has something in it, makes me extremely fucking violent, and, uh, I literally tried to kill my own mother with it, it's like, uh, My stepdad actually called the police. Called the police. I mean, the police told me to leave. Find somewhere to go. I did. I actually slept at a fucking hotel that night. I learned not to drink. I learned not to drink. Well, that's why I was getting violent towards my mother because my mother's a dumbass. But there's a reason why I was getting violent because she's a stupid fucking idiot. She really said something stupid and I was ready to kill her. My stepdad, ca my stepdad called the cops on me. Cops came in. They like, yeah, you've been drinking, but you have to go somewhere. And I. So well, I'm gonna go next door, and I went next door, and I talked to the owner of the uh, uh, the place he used to work at, and I said, "Hey, listen, if I stay with her, I'm gonna kill her." And the cops told me to leave. So I'm doing just that, and I get the fuck out of there for the night. You ask Angie when you see her on Sunday. She'll tell you. 
After she talked shit about your nephew, I, was, I threatened to kill her again. I was, I was ready to... And I wasn't even drunk. Like, I had to... Oh, so bad. I wasn't even drinking. I did, Literally, I was drinking coffee. I was on my way out. I think I was on my way out to work. Yeah, I was I was heading on the work. I told her, you ever talk shit about him again, I'll kill you. Well, yeah, we know. We know your uh, your egg is worse. <laughs> I didn't say yours was. Uh, I'm not trying to compare mothers, but oh my god, yours and mine would probably get along just fine. These are fake doors. Well, they're, they're pretty stupid. Both of them are pretty stupid. Both of them are very stupid. really heard from him like he called me a couple like called me like a month ago I've been meaning to call him but it just been I've just been so fucking busy with work and everything so it's like I barely have enough time for myself but Sissy should be here in a couple couple weeks so get to look forward to that. <clears throat> Can't wait. I haven't seen her in three years, so like I said, you and you and uh you and the sister should pop over and come see her. So she'd be happy to see you. I don't think we're gonna have Nick. So I don't know. Uh, like I said, I spoke to him on I think it was like Thanksgiving. I spoke to him on Thanksgiving. A little bit briefly. Send this uh send us a Christmas card. My other friend sent one. He's like, Mr. Shitmas. Mr. Shitmas sent me a fucking Christmas card, but, you know. He hates Christmas, but he's going to give you a Christmas card. <clears throat> so it's a grin saying, I hate Christmas, but I'm going to give you a card. Here. <laughs> uh, uh, crazy. People are sometimes cray cray. Yeah. Hey. That'd be weird. I'll have to, like, get two weeks before Christmas. What is it like? Come <sighs> on, let me help. Not that that's gonna happen. 
We got a couple weeks before Christmas. I think I go on vacation after. Yeah, the day after. Like we're we're actually. It's kind of funny. We're actually closed on a Sunday. This can be first in a long time. We're actually closed on a Sunday. Christmas is on a Sunday, and we're actually closed on a Sunday. Which is crazy. She made this thing though. Funny feeling I have to go up here, but it won't let me. You uh, finally uh, started your cyberpunk yet, or you still waiting? Don't tell me you're still waiting. Be next year by the time you actually start that fucking game. I think he's waiting for next year. <laughs> then make some. Think bad, you can move it around. I do it all the time on my Xbox. Series X and S. Do it all the time. Oh, taking up too much space. Alright, I'll just move this off. I do it all the time. Or trying to find like uh, another hard drive or a thumb drive or something. If you have one laying around. Let me guess, you haven't even, you haven't even attempted Doom Eternal yet. <laughs> nope. Yeah, I know, I remember you told me you stopped working. How, how old is it? Is it under warranty? Probably not that old. Yeah, I know you are. Alright, let's take a short intermission real quick. Um, I'm gonna go get some eggnog. That sucks. You should have gotten the warranty. Alright, I'll be right back.
What'd you run out of? <laughs> what the fuck did you run out of? Oh, that's really good. Eggnog with, eggnog with whiskey in it. That's kind of cool. Didn't know I can do that. You ran out. So, so your warranty ran out. No, I don't have any more drives. I'd give you one, but I don't have one. It should have said something. Jesus, where are they all coming from? Yeah, the one that I had for... The one I had for the PS4 was a uh, four terabyte. I pretty much have a good amount of space now. Cause I have uh. To six terabytes of hard drive space, then two terabytes of hard drive space of SSD because mine my system is a uh, series, so my SSD is two terabytes, and then includes the card. Where are they all coming from? Holy shit! Jesus! Yeah, I think I have I have two terabytes. Then come on, you son of a bitch! Yeah, I have, um, I have two terabytes of regular, fine, we'll do this. Come on. This level is annoying. I actually taste really good. That's dangerous. That drink is dangerous.
Foxy Hick. Die, will ya? No, the one of them drinking actually added I added stuff to it. So It's just dangerous. My God. I know, I've, I've had it, but this one I made myself. I just added uh, my alcohol to it. And it actually tastes pretty fucking good. You should bring over alcoholic eggnog. Well, the eggnog, the eggnog I'm drinking, this stuff right here. Is actually um almond 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 eggnog. Comes from Price Shopper. Come on. They just keep coming. And not in a good way. <laughs> Just die. Oh my god. So I see that. Ugh. I <sighs> don't help. Yeah, when you come over, I'll show you my, uh... <laughs> I do, too. Um... I haven't been it yet. Well, I, I've been it before, but I just haven't been it... ...on the serious console. Beat it on... Beat it on PlayStation. Remember that day, I remember I told you that I never thought I'd see the day where Stubbs of Zombie is on Sony. Never thought I'd see Cuphead on Sony. I'm crazy. Never thought I'd see that. <laughs> I 
finally. You played Cophead yet? Uh, it's coming to Game Pass. It's uh, done by the same guy that made Rick and Morty. I actually am looking forward to playing it. I'll let you know how it is. I'm gonna uh, dump some space and uh... Dump some space over the weekend. Well, the funny thing is I'm getting close to... Getting close to beating DMC, so I could probably finish that up and just... Download High on Life. And uh... Play that over a weekend or something. It looks really good. Like, I'm a big Rick and Morty fan, and I love Rick and Morty, so. Definitely a game I do plan on, uh, plan on picking up. Or just playing on Game Pass. We are now reaching to the point. <sighs> I haven't played part two yet. Still playing part one. We are to the point now where we are going to be playing $70 for video games. <laughs> I don't agree with it and I don't like it, but it's what's happening. But yes, I do plan on uh, downloading High on Life for the series. My series console. Yeah, for, yeah, well, the new first party titles like High on Life and games like that are going to cost 70. High on Life is probably going to be 70 bucks. You gotta love inflation. Yeah, I know it's 40 bucks, but I don't think I have the the money right now to get that because uh, I just literally just dropped 70 on the new controller. Brand new, uh, I think it's called the Luminati or something. The Luma, it's called the Luma controller. It's silver on the top and. It's got white accents and shit. It looks really, really cool. And, uh... I just dropped $70 at GameStop for it. (laughs) 
That one hurt. Seventy dollars, fucking controller. That one hurt a lot. That was painful. That was a very, very painful purchase. Ugh. No, I did not. I'm playing the game. I'm still playing the game, and I, like I said, I just dropped seventy dollars on a new controller. It's called the Luna. That's what it's called. It's called the Xbox Luna. Is what it's called. It's a new controller. That was. That was a ouch. My heart hurts. Ouch purchase. Ugh. No good to see it though. It's kind of cool. It's a cool controller. AJ likes it, but like, yeah, this is a seventy dollar controller. Ouchie. <sighs> All because I got stick drift. Stick drift for my. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's not bad. <sighs> fucking stick drift on my fucking Series S controller. And that was probably because I was playing, uh, what game was I playing? did that. Oh, I forgot the name of it. Metal Hell, Metal Hell Singer. Metal Hell Singer did it. But, yep. down there Dead end. Yeah, I don't know if I can down. I downloaded a Far Cry Five off Game Pass. I haven't played it yet. I'm playing way too many fucking games. <laughs> Playing way too many games. Oh, made it. Do you have them all on digital or do you have them? Do you have them up mix like me? Physical and digital. disc I do I do no you 
do realize this are getting obsolete. Like I have, how many discs do I have? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven disc games, and like something like a hundred and there's like a hundred and two, no, close to two hundred, close to two hundred digital. Digital is the way of the future. Pretty much already there. I have max pain on, yeah, max pain on digital. I have. Far Cry in. I don't know if you remember this one. Far Cry Instinct Classic. Far Cry Classic. Oh, I haven't played it yet. I used to. I used to have it on disc back in the day. My my original. Yeah. My original, my original OG Xbox, I had it on that. It's fun, fun game. Pain in the ass though, it's still a fun game though. A lot, of the, a lot of the Far Cry games are a fucking pain. <laughs> See, you notice that. A lot of the fucking Far Cry games are a pain. <sighs> Die already. Thank you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Excuse me, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh god. <sighs> Did not want to sneeze like that. Sorry.
Ugh. That was a big sneeze. <laughs> that was a hot shoe moment right there. God damn pig. Thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, man. That was a big hot shoe. Two of them, not just one, two of them. Oh. Whew. Never had one of those sneezes that just sends chills right down your spine. Ugh. I love about Doom. Just be just the exploration. The fuck? Little bastard. Quitting out. All right, so that's it for me. It's about 11:20. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and kill this nog real quick. So, thank you guys for tuning in to doing coffee tonight. Appreciate it. That was all strong. Uh, um. I'll be back tomorrow. Um, not sure. Not sure what I'm gonna do, but uh, I'll be back tomorrow. Vampire definitely join tomorrow. 
I'll uh, see everybody in the next one. Stay safe, stay gaming, and uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. You better. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm bouncing. I'll see everybody later.